Okay, today I'm going to be doing something completely awesome, especially if you're a science nerd like me. I'm going to be reaching temperatures only 63 degrees above absolute zero, so around 63 Kelvin. I'm going to be making solid nitrogen. So I have some liquid nitrogen in this bowl here. So what's gonna happen here is I'm gonna put the liquid nitrogen in the vacuum chamber, I'm gonna reduce the pressure, and what that's going to do is it's going to continually boil the liquid nitrogen and it's gonna boil more rapidly than it would do in normal pressure. And the reason is because it's at a lower atmospheric pressure, so it will boil at a lower temperature. And as it boils, it's going to reduce the temperature of the liquid nitrogen and it's going to get to a lower and lower temperature until it gets to its freezing point. And then what I'm gonna to attempt to do is to knock the solid nitrogen out of the container so you can see that it really is a solid and it's gonna look like a solid snowball of nitrogen. Okay, trying to form solid nitrogen in a vacuum chamber. Three, two, one. So you can see some solid on there. That solid is actually water vapor, so that's ice in there. Not solid nitrogen. So our pressure here is at around 0.1 bars. So we're getting down to the triple point of nitrogen now, so we should start seeing some solid forming. No, there's a solid, it's turning into a solid, look at that. You see it? Oh, that's awesome. That's solid nitrogen. The coldest thing you've ever seen. Wow, that's so cool. So this is something that's a gas at room temperature. I just turned it into a solid. That's amazing. Okay, so we've completely frozen it solid now. Okay, so this solid is around 63 Kelvin. That's only 63 degrees above absolute zero. Okay, I have an idea here that I've never seen. How about we try to knock over our solid nitrogen so you can see how a solid it really is here. Let's see what we can do. Okay. <laughs> Almost knocked it out. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Look at that. That's awesome. Wow, I've never seen that before. I've seen experiments done with it, but I've never seen it come out of the container. <laughs> Look at that. We have a solid nitrogen snowball. So this solid nitrogen is actually one of the major components of the surface of Pluto. So that tells you a little bit how cold Pluto is. Okay, I'm gonna lit in the air now, and we should see that solid just disappear essentially, or at least turn back to liquid and then disappear. Okay, let's lit, it, lit in the air. Three, two, one. Oh, it's turning back into a liquid. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, that was so cool. I've never seen that before. Hey, thanks for watching another episode of Hydraulic Press Action. Remember to leave me some comments in the comments section with what you liked, what you'd like to see next time. You can see me put in my vacuum chamber and my hydraulic press or shoot something with my ping pong cannon. And I'll see you next time.